This video is brought to you by 3, bringing you 4G at no extra cost and some exclusive deals over at btech.com. Hey guys, welcome to BTEC. This is Basil here with Huawei MediaPad X1. Now the MediaPad X1 isn't really old news per se, but it's nothing too fresh. We saw it at MWC. But what we can talk about now in a lot more detail is our favorite thing about it. In fact, one of our favorite things at MWC in general this year, and that's the reverse charging this thing supports. So it's got a 5,000 milliamp battery. The 5,000 milliamp battery on this tablet slash phone, so tablet effectively, can actually charge your smartphone. If you've got an iPhone with a roughly 1,400 500 milliamp battery, you can charge it around three times over, which is mind blowing. Well, we're gonna actually demonstrate that function now, but what we're gonna do first is just walk you around this tablet because it's the second time we've ever seen one in the flesh. You've got a seven inch full HD display, five megapixel front facing camera, IPS display, and it's pretty striking. It does look a little bit like an eye device, but Huawei's made it their own in a few ways. On the right hand side, you can see a micro SIM slot and a micro SD card slot, volume rocker and a power button. At the base, that all too famous micro USB port for the reverse charging, no buttons on the left, while up at the top, 3.5mm jack, flipping it around 13 megapixel rear facing camera, flash, and loudspeaker. This thing has a Kirin 910T processor, actually, a Kirin 910 processor. Um, it's quad core 1.6 gigahertz, 2 gig RAM, 16 gig internal storage. Cap 4 LTE means you're going to get super fast internet on the go, but we're talking about everything other than the reverse charging. First thing you're gonna to need to do for the reverse charging is get one of these. This cable is a Huawei female USB to male micro USB cable. Stick this in the bottom of your Huawei MediaPad X1. You've got a regular USB cable for charging now, and we can pull that into frame. And taking a look at this P6, you can see the battery icon indicates 36%. Plug this in right here and it's charging. It really was that simple. So you've got the charging icon going on right there. Um, all in all, therefore, we really, really want this functionality to hit other devices. Imagine if an iPad with its massive, massive battery could charge your iPhone. You could do that 10 times over almost. Okay, maybe not quite 10, but you get the idea. Other manufacturers take note. This is what Huawei is doing, and we want it to be on every device in the future. Hopefully you've enjoyed. Hopefully you found this interesting. If you've got any questions, fire them in the comments section below. I've been Basil with BTEC. Like the video if you do. Subscribe if you want more of the same. And head over to BTEC where you can find the latest in smartphones, tablets, smart gadgets, and some awesome deals as well. At the top of the screen is where you can find three hand-picked videos for your viewing pleasure. On the left is where you can subscribe, and on the right-hand side you can find some exclusive deals if you head over to btext.com.